the crypto market seems to be in the last stages in the Indian market. Forget acceptance of the currency, even its trading exchanges are in threat. It is speculated that 10 crypto exchanges have aided in money laundering of 1000 crore rupees. Now, this matter is in the hands of ED and as per reports, ED has seized assets of Wazirx. It is alleged that the company with links to China had transferred 100 crore rupees in crypto coins abroad. Exchanges ignored all the rules and let the company do it. KYC was neither done nor documents were asked for it. It seems that ED has seized the assets of Wazirx in light of money laundering case. There are now 65 crore rupees in account. It is possible that the situation is similar with all 10 exchanges on ED's radar. Now, money of all those investors can get stuck who invested in crypto for some quick money. This is not the first case of such allegations on crypto exchanges. This year in March, the government told parliament that 11 crypto exchanges have evaded 81 crore GST. When it came to attention, all the money was collected along with penalty of 14 crore rupees. Wazirx, CoinDCX and CoinSwitch Kuber were said to have evaded the maximum amount of tax. For cryptocurrency, which is getting beaten down and for investors facing loss, there is some good news from US. Bitcoin and Ether can come under the purview of commodity regulator. For this, bill was passed in the parliament there. Now it seems that crypto can get acceptance in the biggest economy of the world. But in India, with allegations on crypto exchanges, path ahead doesn't seem easy. RBI has already warned against it. 